Every year, thousands of people from around the world descend upon the Black Rock Desert of Nevada. There, they will build an airport, a bus station, a cafe, a temple, and a man. From the dust of the playa will rise the third largest city in the state, and just over a week later, it will disappear without a trace. They call it Black Rock City, and you may know it as Burning Man. But for many of the participants, it's simply home, and everything outside the playa becomes the default world. Hello, my name is Mark Kaplan, and in 2013, I made my first voyage to Burning Man, and my life hasn't been quite the same since. For 28 years, Burning Man has been providing citizens of Black Rock City with transformative experiences, events that cause us to reconsider what's really important in our lives and what it means to share the world around us. But home isn't just the Black Rock Desert. For thousands more who can't make it to Burning Man, regional groups taking place annually in over 20 states and 15 nations bring the playa even further into the default world. The focus of my project is to visit these burgs, both in the United States and abroad, to discover what drives people to create and share their art, their talents, and their dreams. And how do their experience at Burns carry over into their daily lives, affecting the world around them? Working in conjunction with the Burning Man Project, local coordinators, and regional burn and theme camp organizers will bring you a vivid display of these colorful communities and let them tell their stories in their own words. In the tradition of Burning Man, we'll be participants, and in the spirit of National Geographic, explorers. <laughs>